Oh, hi there. This is Thermos Jar. And I want to speak about Helldivers today. Because I've been kind of following the whole Di Helldiver 2 saga since the beginning it came out. I bought the game. I loved it. It was great. But uh, if we catch up with all the debacles that went along was the Sony PSN sign in. After that, there we had the, uh, you know, that. Uh, you know, banning all 170 countries, allowing not allowing people to buy game anymore, which alienated practically more like half of the player base. And right now I'm sitting in a position where I can't recommend my friends to play this because it's like, imagine this awkward silence when, oh, let's play Helldivers. Oh, you have it, Sonny? Uh, Sonny is apparently from, let's say... One of the countries listed in 170 countries listed that they can't get the game. And he's like, yeah, sure, I'm, I'm hyped to play it. And I'm sitting there in the background and said, I don't think you'll be able to play Sony. And Sony goes to the Steam page and he sees a big middle finger. Wait, wait, why don't I have the game, Sony says. And then I explained to Sony, like, uh, these guys who are from these countries that the game is out and it's fine, they don't care and they suggest playing with you, Sony, but... We can't play Sony. We got kicked out of that club. And the guys, obviously, who have the game, who keep playing, have no problems. They just go, meow, meow, we don't care. They have the game. They find it's perfect, fine. But us who can't, we can't. We have problems. Uh, but that's old news. There's definitely was some other debacles with the studio, like Arrowhead CEO stepped down. Uh, some other shit happened. You know, it's normal. But. What is not normal and actually needs attention is the politics and behavior of individuals that are injecting their beliefs and their, you know, thinking ways into something where they shouldn't. I'm talking about what happened past week. I've been... Banned, obviously, from Hell Divers uh, Discord server. It's, I mean, come on, why? How can I not be banned? Listen to me. But my friend is not, and he was following the events which he informed me about, which is the person getting other people who reacted with emoji vomit on furry art banned. Like those guys got banned. Kicked out, warned, threatened, no, not threatened, but definitely in a way affected in being access to the server. So I was like, no fucking way when I found out. I was like, hell no fucking way. So I brought up that one of those posts of one of those moderators did. I mean, he is definitely into, into that. that. That's his thing. But let's all remember how... This is, cannot be in an area where people are coming from mostly different places, different beliefs, and different cultures. Your shit is not flying in many areas where this is, this is not necessary. What I'm trying to say in general, this is actually a very difficult topic because... It's today's, in a way, problem. It's just gays versus straights, and it's just everywhere. It's, it's a really fundamentally flawed topic, simply because there's no end to it. Uh, the conversations can be going forever, and uh, there will never be a final decision or a solution, simply because there will never be agreement. It's either you agree with it, with even though you don't agree with it, but it's always going to go in a circle. You might just say fake shit like, yeah, yeah, gay, yeah, yeah, we need that gay stuff. It's really necessary. But deep down, you will be saying, I don't like it. This is going to ruin my stuff. This is going to ruin my game, my movie, my comic, everything else, because genders and gay stuff is actually ruining specific medias Simply because the writers and the creators have no idea or any knowledge or any skill 
implementing it correctly, naturally, so that the player would not feel prejudice against uh, somebody who is gay, who likes boys, like, boy likes boys, I mean, do you really care if it's really not in your fucking face, like, I bet you don't, like, personally, when I played Metal Gear back in the day, that, that didn't fucking stick to me, I just, I saw those characters, I was like, oh, okay, cool, I guess, I mean, they're still fun characters, right? You just it just flew over your head because when when you meet the actual, you know, appropriate individuals who are not the same sexuality with you, they will not be cringe as fuck in your face talking about gay rights. That's just the fucking pollution of internet. But let's go back to the topic since this is very heavily politicalized topic i want to bring out the furry degeneracy crap that is being going on in helldivers uh discord uh first of all i believe that your beliefs and your a appreciation of art and how you see things should not affect judging others and should not be in a way fundamentally shaping a uh, server of this on discord because what happened now with uh, the hell divers thingy the moderator is apparently a very into furry porn i mean sorry furry art and uh, everybody who doesn't like it and simply saw no necessary for that thing to be was chastised ridiculed and uh, ultimately removed you're sitting there and i'm sitting here and the people i was sitting here watching this since let's let's do a little reminder i'm removed from the server but i was removed for complaining about 170 countries this is different i just think that the developers and sony they being very inappropriately shit at their jobs apparently because the game is stagnating because of developers and sony is doing nothing to ensure quality over a shitty quantity i'm pretty goddamn aware that the develop too i mean sorry about the um, moderators going under their political bullshit and since you we all know those mods, they go into these power hungry phrases. And if you don't like what they say, they'll just fucking ban you and get rid of you. Because you're nobody on these servers. The problem with Discord servers is because you're nobody on them. You say anything, the little gangs will gang up on you. And you're going to be always alone unless you build up your own following and blah, blah, blah. It's, it's just a circle never ending. What's my point with this video? I think, personally, this should be seen by all, and this should be an example of not to do in your Discord community. Discord is fast responsive, problems arise, content disc uh, discussion, and etc, etc. But it's not your fucking personal uh, furry art exhibition and uh, fan art of fucking foxes in Helldiver equipment. That's not what it should be. So, are these uh, mods at fault? I think you kind of understand this fucking recording that I'm against it. And I think everybody should see this. Since expression is okay, as long as it's in the boundaries of your own bedrooms and your own thing. And not when it comes to a product that is being now <laughs> run into the ground anyway. I still love watching what's happening, but yeah, come on, Sony and Arrowhead, you fucked us up ever already. But how about you stop this shit's happening? This is fucking embarrassing. Oh, just just for an update, let's go check a uh, Helldiver store. Um, yeah, fuck you, there you go. I'm still not able to buy it again. I cannot give this to my friend or anything. I'm just still kicked out. So with this video. This was not scripted. I literally just spoke out of my heart. It's um, it's sad in the end, but it is what it is, guys. Have a nice day. Have a nice week. Goodbye.